tonight we're going to talk about how to use a lubricant correctly. So throughout my over six years in my Pyramus business, I've met hundreds of women who struggled with personal dryness, whether that's from medication, because that's a huge one, uh, having children, stress, and just not being able to turn off your brain. And it's nothing to be ashamed about. It's something that does happen, especially as we get older. But there is a right way to go about using a lubricant. And I've met these women who have bought lubricants from us and they say, you know what, I've tried all these different lubricants and it's not working for me. And I was really confused because we have incredible quality products and even two of our lubricants are FDA cleared for it. So I was really surprised that so many women were still struggling with dryness after using a lubricant. So asking them questions like, can you walk me through how you're applying it? I found out that the majority of the women that I've met are just not using lubricants correctly. And this isn't to bash women because you know they don't teach us this in fifth grade sex ed, but really to educate you on how we should be using lubricants so that we can get the desired effect that you really want. So if you are using one of our lubricants like just like me or the euphoria water-based lubricant um, you want to apply one pump onto your finger now this is what most women do most women either put it externally on the vulva area outside of the labia your lips or they're applying directly to the toy or to a penis and that's actually where it's, it's wrong. So we really want to be protecting the tissues internally. These are really delicate and anytime uh, there's friction or if you have an itch down there and you scratch it, that's so delicate and thin that that's what causes the tearness and the pain after intercourse or even foreplay. And so a lot of times when you're only applying it externally, you're protecting this area here, but you're still penetrating and causing friction internally. And this, like I said, is the area we want to protect. And so when you apply one pump to your finger, you're going to insert into the vaginal canal and just about one to two inches and you're going to rub it around let it absorb and it's good and so if you're using a water-based lubricant one of ours uh, because you are applying this internally you can actually apply this up to 24 hours before and it's going to absorb into your tissues and when you get aroused whether it's an enhancement cream foreplay a toy anything like that it's going to re-wet and replenish to give you that protection if you are using a silicone based lubricant like our pure pleasure you're going to apply it the exact same way but instead of it absorbing, it's going to stay on top of the tissues to really prevent friction. So the Pure Pleasure is perfect for those who have dryness and have absolutely no production of self-lubrication. Or, you know, this is also good for backdoor play, water play, whereas a water-based lubricant is perfect and ideal for someone who has natural production of lubricant. So I hope that helps. And if you have questions on how to apply a lubricant, please feel free to reach out.